Park Jae Sun Biography, Wiki. Park Jae Sun was a South Korean comedian and actress who debuted in 2007 under KBS. She appeared on variety shows and hosted several events such as press conferences and showcases. Official, Park Jae Sun was today found dead at her home in Maypo District, Seoul around 1.44 p.m. Park Jae Sun age. Sun was 36 years old as of 2020. Park Jae Sun education, family, career. Park Jae Sun was born on November 3, 1984, in Incheon, South Korea. She went to Korea University. An undated photo released by South Korea's Yonhap News Agency on November 2, 2020 Sun debuted in 2007 as the 22nd openly recruited comedian for the Korean broadcasting system. She starred in a corner of gag concert called Gag Warrior 300 which brought laughter. She won the Newcomer Award at the KBS Entertainment Awards in 2007. I am lucky as a comedian that I can use my face to make people laugh," she said in an interview with the Hankura newspaper. Park Jae Sun Death and Cause of Death Park's father contacted the police after the comedian and her mother didn't respond to the father's phone call. The bodies of Park Jae Sun and her mother were found by police, Yonhap News Agency reported. On November 2, a source from Seoul Maple Police Station stated that Park Jae Sun and her mother were discovered dead in their home in Maple District, Seoul at approximately 1.44 p.m. KST. Park was reportedly being treated for an unspecified illness, and the Seoul Shinmen newspaper cited a police officer as saying there were no signs of outside intrusion or murder. Cause of death The cause of her death is still unknown as it is still being investigated. The police stated that no signs of homicide were found. However, police suspect the comedian and her mother have taken their own lives. Suicide is a chronic social problem in highly competitive South Korea, according to government data. Several South Korean celebrities have killed themselves in recent years, among them K-pop singers Guhara and Sully, both of whom had been subjected to vicious cyberbullying 